This is AP News Minute. Treasury Secretary Henry Paulson says global financial markets remain severely strained. He's calling for quick action to implement the government's $700 billion rescue program. And he says the administration is moving fast to begin the largest government rescue effort in history. On Wall Street, stock prices finished lower again after swinging back and forth for hours. The day began with interest rate cuts by central banks around the world and the Federal Reserve cut its key rate a half a percent to 1.5. President Bush is calling it a big deal after signing into law a bill that will allow American businesses to enter India's multi-billion dollar nuclear market. Bush says the measure would build on the growing ties between the world's two largest democracies. Next Vice President of the United States, John McCain. And he's the man who may always be known for confusing Democrat Joe Biden for Republican John McCain. At a rally in Florida, this man introduced VP nominee Biden by mistakenly calling him John McCain. Ed Donahue, The Associated Press, with AP News Minute.